can you tell us how do you hope your story will inspire other inspire other people, especially those who may be struggling with similar challenges or facing adversity in their lives? I want to encourage them that this this thing was predestined. Mm. See, the Bible say before we was even formed mm. in our mother's womb, yes. there was already a prophetic word yes. that was spoken over our life. Yes. And so Jeremiah 1 and 12 say he watches over his word to perform it. Mm. So I want to encourage anybody that's looking at this show to let them know that your past does not dictate your future, but God would turn that pain into purpose. He would turn that pain into purpose and he would get all the glory out of our lives. Mm. And it's just, it's the latter shall be better than our former. Yes. So let no obstacles, do not let any obstacles hinder you or keep you from doing what he wants you to do. Let your passion, because see your passion will cause you to over, overpower mm. any obstacle it's that will so come true. in your way. That's yeah. how powerful passion yeah. is to fulfill yes. purpose. Can you tell us what advice would you give? I mean, you know young people, are they're going through such a challenging time right very, now. Very, very challenging. And like you said, in the government or in certain institutions, you're not allowed to say or talk about the Word of God. What, in, what kind of advice would you give young people who want to, to um, be baptized and rededicate their life or even dedicate their life? I would tell them to keep calling on the name of Jesus. Mm. I don't have any other advice to give anybody Except. because, like I say, every system failed me. Mm. And so when I had the encounter with him that night in my bedroom, Valentine's night, 1993, mm. and when he came in, and I mean, it was a wrap. And so after everything else failed me, mm. the infallible, incorruptible word of God was the only thing that was able to save me. Yes. And so when I, I tell people, I don't have anything else. I mean, I wish I can, sometimes you wish you can tell people something else because it seems like they're so far away, but I don't have anything else to tell anybody. Except call. Call. On the, on and the never stop. And don't stop. Never stop. There is because he knows how to break God. through. Mm. Yeah. Not using his name in vain because I think so many times we can say the name, but we say it the wrong way. 